All right, so I'm playing a little Cocto Chosen. I found this game for the original Xbox. Picked it up, saw it at the store. I was like, hold up, man. Let me get this game. Gotta give it a go, man. Gotta play with the boy JD Stone. Like, I never got to play this game in full. I did play the demo when it was, uh, when the demo disc was out a long time ago. I think you got to play with, like, uh, Rayco, Ragey, what else do you name is? The Bruce Lee looking dude with the scratched up body. You know, uh, you got to play with him on the demo disc. So, you know, the game got banned a long time ago for like a, a Muslim chant or something in one of the uh, soundtracks to the game. But, you know, again, I never got to play it. I always wanted to play it because, you know, I, I like 3D fighters, DOA, Tekken. This, this game, in a sense, you know, I guess it was supposed to be the Xbox version of Tekken, even though I would like to say that it's more dead or alive-ish, due to the fact that, you know, it's, it's more freelance button presses. I don't want to say button mashing, but, you know, then you have a block button, virtual fighter-ish. Okay. Shit. Alright. <laughs> Make sure I don't get KO or try to catch him with some fancy shit. But I almost got my ass whooped. Anyways, man, like, I don't know. I, I just picked this game up. I also picked up Tile Fing, Fist of the Lotus. You know, I haven't played that game in forever. It was a fairly decent game back in the day. You know, like, coming off of Mortal Kombat Deadly Alliance. You know, I was hoping, I was like, oh man, John Tobias made this game, so I'm like, I'm hoping that it was going to be just as good as Deadly Alliance, and it, it was alright, man, it was fairly decent, like, I liked the damage system, that was like the one thing I did, like, uh, I didn't really care for the combos, because they did not feel fluid, and I'm not going to lie, like, for the most part, the combos on this game actually feel kind of fluid, which... I mean, of course, I'm not doing much. Then you see I got the, got the crazy dodge dip game out here. Look, look at the dip game. That Steve Fox ain't got shit on me, man. I'm out here dancing. Uh, but, uh, yeah. So I picked up Tyler Fang. I also picked up uh, NCAA College Basketball 2K3. And ESPN uh, it was College Hoops 2K5. I think it was called College Hoops at the time. But... Yeah, man, I, I picked up those four OG Xbox Round games. Two. Uh, the two basketball games actually work on the Xbox 360, so I will be playing those on the Xbox 360. You know, give it a slight, uh, you know, graphic boost. You know, put it in, like, semi-true 720p. And not this simulated 720p, because I have this uh, converter thing that lets you up render composite cables to either 720 K or 1080 oh. and I don't see a point in up rendering to 1080 what? because it actually still has a 480 picture you know a 480p picture so it doesn't really matter if you up render it or not but man it's you know it's kind of it's kind of cool going back and playing these old games you know I you know I I'm one of those people man like I occasionally have fun going back and playing old games. Currently, right now, the game I'm really on is Persona 5. I just picked it up. Hey, I can't lie. Normally, I'm not really into turn-based RPGs much. I did play Persona 4. I thought that was a you know, cool game. But it came out like forever ago. Then, you know, they had the, the fight game. I thought that was kind of fun. Uh, you know, I didn't think they were as good as like Blade Blue or Guilty Gear, but you know, they were, they were pretty fun. Uh, but yeah, man, Persona 5, pretty good game. I also oh. picked up Blaze Blue Central Fiction, finally. Haven't really touched it. I think I played with Noel, played like one online match, and that was it. Uh, I don't know, the game just feels, feels a little different. Uh, whenever I have free time, I'll get on it. Uh, of course, MLB The Show 17. Still playing X. Pretty good game. Still in the minor leagues. Trying to get the hell out of there. 
doing damage. Oh, shit, hold up, man. Only from the looking like double dragon, uh, shadow ball, <laughs> shadow master out here whooping my ass, man. Damn, shadow master put the beats on me. Okay. Oh. All right. Maybe I need to concentrate the hell off this mic because normally, you know, I don't talk, man. I ain't got shit to say. Hopefully, man, by tomorrow, man, my channel is free. It's free from being held captive, man. That Logic album out. Love it. Love it. Had an issue. I pre ordered it. And it wouldn't give me my goddamn album. It was like, yo, it's coming out May 6th. I was like, no, nah, man. It's supposed to come out May 5th. And then, it, then like immediately, I took a nap. I woke up. And it was on my phone. I was like, "Thank you, man." Future dropped the mask off video. Finally, it might be a little too late, but he finally dropped that video. You know, pretty good video. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, until next time, I'll holler at you dudes later. Bad luck, eh? One fight. What the fuck? Bro, really? Come on, man. Fuck. Hey, what the fuck? Turn around, fool.